Rather a wet, miserable day, alas, here in North London at the Emirates Stadium. I'm Derek Ray, joined for commentary by the former Arsenal defender Lee Dixon. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's Arsenal up against Crystal Palace. Cheers, Derek. Yes, excited about this one. Interesting matchup for me. We should get a good game here, hopefully. It's a controlled Aubameyang run. And so the starting 11 for Arsenal. Bernd Leno stands between the posts. Mohamed El Nene starts with Thomas Partey in central midfield. And operating in attack today, Pierre Emerick Aubameyang. Arsenal pushing forward with options available. And a throw in it's going to be. Dan. The defenders will certainly have done their homework, Lee, and on that basis must keep more than a weather eye on Lacazette. Well, how'd you stop him? Four goals in three games. I suggest the defenders, not just one of them, twos and threes might be the case. And is it going to be Willian? And a goal to open the scoring. No wonder they're celebrating. One nil then. Bukayo Saka. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Kieran Tierney. And he favours the inside route. And a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Ayu. It's opening up for them. McCarthy. Good use of the ball, but can they trouble the defence? Big chance to get them on terms. And he's got and scored to level it again. Well, the earlier goal cancelled out. One apiece. Thomas. Well, couldn't keep it. And play halted, free kick given. Getting in there to take it away. Thomas. Well, that ball looks promising. Bayerine. And here's Partey, and he's broken free. And a goal to re-establish their advantage. Just look at the celebrations. Back underway, Arsenal with the lead. What can he do from here? What a genuine opportunity, but it was squandered. Goal kick. Well, they've jumped in front, Lee. That's the most important thing. Your assessment so far? Well, Arsenal will be happy if it stays like this. There's still some work to do in the second half, though. With the clock ticking down before their half-time cup of tea, the players have to stay concentrated. Run it magnificently and intercepted. Lacazette. El Elneny. Not a huge chunk of added time. One minute. William not messing around with that clearance and there it is the half-time whistle
The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. And good pressure high up the pitch. Lacazette. And Aubameyang now. Bukayo Saka. And now with Aubameyang. Well, that's the kind of player you want from your defender. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, Derek, it certainly was a good 45 minutes from the lad. Obviously got the goal to give him the lead, but he's looked very, very lively as well. Willian. Thomas now. Untidy in possession. Townsend. Just cutting off the supply. Lacazette. Partey. Well read to ease the pressure. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. And fed forwards. Wilfried Zaha. Well, he made sure there was absolutely no way through. El Nenny. Bukayo Saka. It's with Gabriel. Spraying passes around, almost waiting for the opposition to make a mistake. Bukayo Saka. Now Lacazette. Sloppy with the ball, Nathaniel Klein. Pass through the middle for William. Bayerine. Here's William. Now Bayerine. And William on the move here. Bayerine. Thomas now. Options in the middle. El Nenny. Now Aubameyang. He takes aim. And no worries for the goalkeeper. Just ten minutes to go. James McCarthy. Kuyate now. Patrick van Aanholt. How can they turn one of these attacks into a goal? The referee correctly decided to play advantage. Free kick awarded then by the referee. He's been admonished by the referee. He's now got to walk something of a tightrope. Yeah, he knows exactly where he stands. Look at the referee, how he's told him off there. No yellow card, but certainly knows what the referee's thinking. Can he do it? To the new point final, number 20, Christian Benteke. And number 23, Michi Batshuan. Thomas. El Nenny with it. Inside the final two minutes of this contest. Dan. Well, they're attacking, but time is the great enemy. The referee has decided there will be just one minute of added time. William. And the referee blows his whistle. Now we can...